What's going on guys, Son of Beast here, welcome back to another Stanley Cup Playoffs. This next matchup is about to be happening in Game 3 in Tampa Bay, as the Toronto Maple Leafs face against the Lightnings at the Amala, the Amali Arena. Yeah, that is the next stop that happened here since the first season. We know that the Tampa Bay have already made a shocking loss, a disappointment, right against the Montreal Canadiens since the... Stanley Cup Finals of last season. Well, and now they're in trouble now because they are still playing against the Canadian matchup. And I'm not sure what's going to happen. Well, there's a chance that the Tampa Bay Lightnings can definitely make if they wanted to take their adding pressure lead to head them off. Austin Matthews, then we have Mitchell Marner, John Towers. They're ready to make things happen. And the other hand is Victor Hedman, Andre Velevsky and and Nikiti Kucherov. Unfortunately, you don't see Ryan McDonough. Well, what happened? Well, you you're never gonna know what happened to him because this is this is a change of a lineup. According to Ryan McDonough, it looks like he's he is suffering an injuryness, but we are not sure if he's gonna be in a secondary lineup. We have to keep an eye on them just in case there's a changeup that we have. So, let the games begin at Tor Toronto, right to Tampa Bay, which is the next stop to play here for the next Stanley Cup playoffs of the Eastern Conference. Let's get games begin. And this is a series tied right now. The next stop is going to be the next one to take the lead pressure. It's time to let this game happen. Right now with me, I'm going to be doing some of my commentary myself. It will be hard for me to help me out. The Bolts win some tip-off here, and we are underway. Starting with the lineup here currently, that we have Mariner having in, uh, having in the attack. Also along with Ruda, and then it's, uh, and then it's Vet Vervelski, uh, right with the goalie. Bunting! Stop made by Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky has already got played here before, once and twice. Now for his career this season, it's going to be happening. Austin Matthews has stick him up, and the other team for itself for the player. We have also have Hedman that really wanted to take it all. Not really too much happening going on with the Pats, but they need something else to go from big to big. Oh, get a little point off here. Kucherov loses the puck. Matthews takes it away. Takes it over to Bunning. The Toronto is making their way down to the neutral faceoff zone. The Bolts have it in now in control. Throwing along the boards, not going to work. A lot. Right back in the ever transition. Bad pass. It will have to reset it from the start. Now he moves quickly over to Killorn. Moves it over to Stamkos and it goes offside. They need something a little bit more to get right into pressure on offense because they're not going to get right in time. Neutral faceoff has already won as the play resumes. Krill's got to his own puck. And the attack! He scores! First goal in game three is Anthony Crow. That circular motion, look at this. This is all that happened with the slap shot goal that he now has. Tampa Bay has got themselves in the lead right now. They lead 1-0. Yeah, it's hard to see them play. But without any concerns, well, it might be a very tough one to make, a, make the matchup even more impossible that they have. Now it's McDonough, as you see right there, he's still playing on, playing on ice. McDonough takes a shot, and it's off the goaltender. Moves a back pass to McDonough. 
Now the Sam Coast. He goes in. Stopped by Campbell. And Campbell has really made a great saving here back in the second game in Toronto. What a terrific sit. What a terrific play they had. They had it all down in mind. They had it all working out like a charm. McDonough moves back to Crinan. Now he moves over to Bellamar. McDonough has his own own on his own. Moves in front. Passes off the goaltender. Goes off wide. Bolts reset repositioned the group. Crinna in in out of it with the puck. Right near the board. Maron gets a gets a cut off and it's taken away. The Bolts have it now on the offensive end. McDonough, a little weak on the pass, but back to McDonough. He shoots wide! Stopped by the goaltender by Campbell. Maroon's got it in across the zone. Crenard inside, going in! And he gets blocked up in traffic. Bellamar. Working our way around back to Maroon. Creeks up. It's a shot denied by, by the goaltender. Now Toronto in control. Oh, he almost picked it up. Parrying along the board. Getting a little physical out there. Now he moves over to Thomas. He moves offside as the good whistle is called. We haven't made their way to the half point position, but Brandon Point, he's got wheels. <laughs> the wheels is only my favorite thing to do. Once uh, once you have cars that have wheels, you go right into position to take the attack. Well, there might be something going on that they really wanted to take. Bruda up, off the goats under the pad, and it's kicked wide. They won't pick up that play. Tampa Bay has got an own offensive end now for the attack. Moves over to Ruda. He shoots up. It goes off target. Hole goes around the uh, other bend now. Moves it quickly over to Marner. Inside and front. Bad and pile out with a broken up pass. Moves in, point out front. Oh, and he gets denied by Hall. New changeup is being occurred. Now up the goaltender on Mavelski. Point into the setup. Goes right to Ruda. Oh, he went back, Bango, with a broken bone. Man, that was a pressure. Now moves it over to Headman. Yeah, it gets starting to get a little physical out there for Toronto. Stamkos, Krella, on off with the puck it goes. Moves the puck up and over to transition again. Oh, gets a little weak out there. Now the offside of a warning will be almost being called here for Tampa. Oh, Hoggo will be taking the puck. We are under 10 minutes left here to play for the first period. Now he moves over to Kerfoot. Moves around the board. Moves over to Hagel. Hagel has to all across the round pass in the neutral zone. Two on one! Oh, McDonough gets denied. He goes in. Oh, it's stopped by the goaltender. He still haven't saved me. Another shot block angle. Riley on to the attack. Gets weaved up. Camp back in there. Off the goaltender. Pulling on the round of the boards. Oh, the weak pass has been signaled up and they have to re resumed it and try to reset it from position. Goes up with the weak pass. Who's over to Koss? 
Now he moves it up along the board. The Bolts work on offensive zones. This one has picked up play. Nylander with the spin move off the goaltender again. That's still not going to help him out. Oh, Volevsky still saving it. Bellomare moves over to Perry. Goes along the board by Bellomar. He goes up with the shot. Weak off signal, but the defensive had him. Ruda up. He moves the shot. And it goes off the target for Campbell. And uh, Campbell will hold the freeze the puck and it will slow things down a bit from the offender in. Still, we have made past the under minute mark of the, of the of the first period, under six minutes left. Foot with the shot, and it's two blocks in a row. Off by Campbell, go with the goaltender of the pad. Off the Sergachev. Sergachev, glove save by Campbell. The Maple Leafs working around there on the puck. Oh, he went back from broken shoes to broken, uh, broken stick out there. And he goes up with a big back release. Wish shot. It gets trapped up by Riley. Now he moves over to Agville. Sharkochev has got his own puck and now though against the boards. Holland with the puck. Now he moves over to foot. He shoots wide. And it's off the goaltender. Foot. That goes in. Shot is blocked again. Looking for a man. Holland moves it over to foot. McDonough back to foot. And they attack. And the shot goes out of control. Great poke check, but not quite enough to get there. Foot blocks the pass. Kukurov has lost the block control. Wow, Kucherov has got an insult. They're just trying to uh, keep an eye on the pressure. He goes in. Shot wide. Kucherov looking for looking for a man to beat the body check. There's a big hit. Or to Bolts. Bolts whipping around here. They go from zip to zip. Joseph, right to like this Crowley. Crenard back to Hadman. Hadman's in! Oh, he gets blocked up in front. Toronto Maple Leafs working on transition again. Oh, and the big hit! Stop by the Walevsky! The Bolts working in their, uh, the offensive end now for their attack. And we approach down to just one minute left in the first period. Wow, what a stop made by Campbell. Another glove save. We're almost finished with the first period. The score now is 1-0 for Tampa Bay. Had been right in the, in the offensive zone. Cast! Stop by Volevsky! And it will freeze the puck as it will now be turning off to get some rehydration. And for Victor Hedman himself, he has got so much uh, popular that he's on the move today. Hole, right to Brady, with the slap shot, glove saved by Milevsky. Cohen, right to Joseph. It's a 2 one Loose the puck, couldn't can't take the force. Ruda, he shoots wide, and it's tipped in! It's Hagel with the backhander! That was definitely close. It looks like Campo was going to try to stop it, but it seems like that Hagel had just put it in there. The puck was out loose. That was way far. The, light, the Bolts have a 2 nothing score in the first period. Took a big kick here before the first period comes to expires. Velevsky with this block. 
And that should do it for the first period. 2 nothing is the score. Toronto and Tampa are going to take some break when we come back for the second period. Period 2 about to start as Vielli ready to shield the ice and for faceoff. And it's Toronto with the puck, and we start your second period in the beginning. Toronto Maple Leafs got in their own the wing. It's bad, broken up. Palat's got puck in control. Moves over the point with the recover. Almost lost the puck anyway, but still recovered. What a save made by Campbell. Now it's the Leafs in, in their own wing. Recovered his own. Now it's Pallad in, in the offensive end. Looking for a man. Kucherov lost the puck and denies. And it won't pick up that play. Kucherov will able to uh, reset their courtesy in the neutral zone. And here comes the fight. This is going to be a very tough situation going on right now. And they are having a weak delayed signal here on the penalty. Body checks him across. Marner in control. Nylander's got their own pocket defensive boards. And the Matthews, big hit, and it went off the skate. And it never goes shot wide. Matthews all in transition. With a back pass, Neander. What good stop by the goaltender. Stamkos got it on, on puck. Moves across the board to Killorn. Moves it quickly over to Hedman. McDonough outside. Shoots inside. Off the pad it goes. That's never saved made by, by Campbell. Campbell really knows his pressure. And because of him, he now knows his secret. He's got a lot of the board to pressure in. Two on one! How did he save that puck already? It was Campbell that did it again. McDonough, right in the wing. Moves up in front. And it's off the goaltender. Moves it quickly over to Sarchak. He loses a puck and it's Brody with a takeaway. The Leafs have their own, own offensive end now from the wing. Scrub save by Velevsky. Well, Velevsky, I meant. Bolts have it on any offensive boarding now. Backhand to the wall to Maroon. They're moving the puck around quickly for the Lightnings to get right by it. Bolts working their way puck around. With the shot off the camp bell. Inside! He loses the puck and it goes up at the stake. Nylander. Inside! And it's tipped away. Bellamar works his way off to Joseph. Back pass doesn't go in wide. Almost wanted to make a body slam out of here. Bolts goes quickly off the boards. And it won't pick up that play. Mateev goes inside, in the crease. It's delivered to save me by Velevsky. Joseph has got him across the board. Now he has his puck control. Now it goes to Hagel. They work it around the way to Joseph. Bad pass to the X. Wow, the big zapper goes with the lightning with the bolt strike. Kucherov's got it on, on, on Buck. Now he slides it over to Ruda. With the shot! Headman with a save by Campbell. Inside it goes! Backhand! That's off the stick. Backhand release! Stopped by the goaltender. Kerfoot's got it on end. Spezza with the attack. Andrew Kreese, Balevsky still saving the puck. Doesn't have any resist up here. 
Point around the board. Oh, it misfires across, and this will have to be a retake for the top. They wanted to make some transition out there. They wanted to fix some things up. Wow, the bolt went down. Stamkos got his puck. We're a midway point to the period of second. Gets a lot of heavy traffic out there. Might need to show something off. You can't waste too much time. You gotta figure it fast. Stamkos in trouble. Passes off to Anvil. Anvil inside. And saved me by Velilevsky. Veselevsky will hold the puck here as we will have, have some break and then get back in action. Jan Ruda went hard hit on the wall. They should have like been called out there. And now he's out already. Got slammed up in the head. A little unconsciousness here from the players, but this looks like it's a lot of uh, attackers up there. Velevsky and Campbell still has a lot of pressure going in from the zones and attacking attack. Toronto resumes the play as they win the faceoff. Glove saved by Velislevsky. We are under a midway midway point as as we have already passed 10 minutes here in the second quarter. Toronto wins again. Neil Anders up on Kremnik. Brody up. Josephs takes the puck away. And this goes with an odd man rush. Off the goaltender, off on Campbell. Wow, he was quick in time. Stopped by goaltender with a glove save. And they will have to uh, reinforce to regroup here to just go back where they played from. They always do, but not really too much happening out there. They need to get someone by to get through, through from the attack zones. Now the Leafs goes back in transition out there. Oh, what a stop made. Almost would have been denied and would have been making the net go in. Oh, has it, has it took away from, from Cole. Kucherov still up here. Nylander, and it's a, and it's a shot blocked. Kranich up. Hagel up on the corner. Moves quickly over to Ruda, and it's a bad miss, rejects it up. Takes a poke check front run off the handle. Hole still has a covered board. Almost went off the band. Bang angle, Vasilek. Wazowski makes a, makes a glove save. Now Marner will reset. Toronto in control. Stick lifted. Bolts have it in control for back going off into bin. And the wrist off target it goes and it just went out of reach. And it goes up again. Pollard. And it's misfires and it will have to stop the play with a minute 5 and 18 left to play in the second quarter of the period. Still 2-0 is a score. They're looking for a shout-out win over Toronto to win the third game. Maroon passes up to Perry. Ruda up again. Ruda up again. With a shot! Stopped by Campbell. And he'll hold the puck with the freeze as this will uh, rehydrate more for each two teams. Still lots of time left here for for the Maple Leafs, and they need something else to go with a different plan. As the make, as the play continues, it is now the Lightning's in possession. He wrist shot! Wow, that goes off the pad, and that was on Campbell with the save. There's still much more going on out there that the Toronto Maple Leafs really didn't. Uh, able to make a score out there. It was very hard. Now they need something else to go with a different fight-off to plan out with the attack. 
Marner up in, up in the, uh, in the Benson board. Pope checked it. Almost went loose. Maroon's got the puck right near the boards. And the attack couldn't find Bellamar with the, with the two on one with a one time shot. And you can see that Tampa is looking for a chance to win the third consecutive uh, Stanley Cup if they wanted to get to the finals. Moves it back to Cerna, and it's a bad pass. Wreaking control, now it's McDonough. McDonough moves the circle, gets beaten up. No penalty on each team here, as he now moves to Matthews. He pokes it away, very clear. And it stops again. We got a lot of raising action out there. Matthews still has it covered. Off the goaltender! Vasilevsky still saves it again. The Bolts back in offensive zones. Two on one, and it gets rejected. Long pass by Kemp. Toronto and the 2 on one Able to save it. Are you kidding me? That was a bell number. Belovsky save though. 2 on one Almost had rejected in there. And it's Campbell with another save made. Kucherov in control. Now goes to Killorn. Last minute left in the second period. He moves up, Kuhn, and Timmy Traffic. Oh, it went off the stick. And the Islander still in out and, and going back where they came from. Moves back over to Ruda. The Bolts have it now in their own offensive end. Two on one, Herman could save it. With a backhand shot, and it's Brody with a rebound, pass up, and that will end the second quarter of the period. It's still no score left here for the second period, but there is a lot of crashing insight saved in these games, and we have one more period to go. We'll be right back after this. As the puck gets ready to drop in, we are back at the MLI Arena. Amali Arena to start the third period. In we're off to go. Let the games finish with the last one in game three. Now here's Pollock. Only hasn't scored that much here so far in the second period of third, but it run really hard to give him a shot. Headman getting a little traffic out there. Ruda over to Headman. Back over to Ruda. With a wrist shot, saving off points, still couldn't find a man opener. Holland went out of reach. Now he quickly move over to Matthews, moves it quickly to Marner. Great poke check here as this one stops the puck. Tampa Bay in control now. Moves it quickly over to Hedman. Back to Stamkos, with the shot, he scores! And that is the third goal. Look at that, Stamkos, you make it snappy. That was his powerful idea to make that happen. Wow, and it's a thunderous noise here at Lightnings. They now extend the lead series 3-0. Toronto wins again another faceoff. As the play continues now, here's Killorn. Went down. Turk around right to Ruda. Back to Hedman. He almost went off the reach. Now he rejects it. Bunting in, in the offense. One on one. Oh, what a stop me. Sorello has gotten a rebounding rejection here, and now he's done it again. Stamkos, Hedman right over to Ruda. 
Ruta back to Circro. Backhand pass to Killorn around the board. Nylander with a takeaway. Now he moves back to Tavir. Off the goaltender. Gets pulled up. Moves over to Maroon. Maroon has it in there on the boards. No man connection opener. And they will have to regroup. Maroon. Backing over to Hedman. Now to, now to Cirello. Almost went up heavy. Campbell saves me with the glove. Now they will reject. No, he will regroup each uh, each teams as he will have to do it again and again. Toronto wins from the defensive zone. Two men goes colliding with a bolt strike. Up around the board. Regrouping now is McDonough. Right to Krenna. Moves it quickly to Perry. Finds him. And a bad pass. That turns to be a turnover again. Here it comes. Krenox has it all recovered. Tampa Bay's got her own offensive board. Backing over is Perry. 2 on 1. Broken up by Brody. Now we're reaching poke check. Mitchell stopped by Velevsky. Wow, looks like Velevsky hasn't made a made a disappointment out there. He is strong on move. He's the king of a lightning to try to stop one. After regrouping each zone, they will have to try again as Perry will have along the board. Off at a point. Point and again. Speed move. Oh, he just couldn't stop one. The save is on Campbell. Matthews right along the board. Toronto going back from the neutral zone. Bunny. Stop me by off the pad. Moreno up in. He scores. There is no shout out win for Lightnings. And the Maple Leafs are on the board. And as you can see right now, the Lightnings have it all in control out there as they now have a 3-1 lead. Now this goes up to Brody. Stopping the play and it's point on the other hand. Now Marner still has it covered out. Stop by Malevsky. Now it's point. And regrouping in, Toronto couldn't find anybody. They wanted to reject here on the offside. And uh, yeah, that's what they have to do. They need to, they need to come up with a different idea. They wanted to get away with the offside. Bunting with the steal. And it's a bad pass as Colton takes it away. Up along the board to search it. And it's just out of reach. Hagel couldn't save it. Now he moves over to Nylander. Hope checked away. Back to Nylander. Back to Colton. Now he does it again. And it just went out of reach. Sarachev still has it along the board. And it's Case with a broken up pass by Sarachev. Riley up to Nylander. Case up front. He scores! That's two in a row for the third period. First goal comes in for Kais. And that was a bigger moment out there as the Leafs are wanting to make a comeback rally without being extended up again. Lilligrain goes out. Gives it to Gilhorn. 2 on 1. Score! Two goals in the game for Krill. And it's a two-point lead for Tampa Bay. Now that's the best smart out there. 2-0-1 was a perfect play. Now you know that Krill has it all along the board. He has it in front. Now he gets a good play, a, a great chance. Bolts have it in and out on the board with a two-point advantage here for a 4-2 lead. What a saving me on this play. 
And now they're just going to need to try to figure things up here to stop them along the board. Kulorn has got another assist here. And Victor Hedman has his second assist here this game. And now this one goes right back to Samkos. New changeup is Maroon. Tavares still has it steal. Poke checked away. Wedge clears the puck down. And we got an icing going on for Tampa. As you know, about Andre Belovsky has a Cortonius that he has all through. With a veteran in position for the drive on attack, he now has his own ability to take it from here. Maroon still has a cover. Back to Krell. Sorelli inside. Shoots wide. Off the goaltender. Maroon. Saved bay by Campbell. And he still couldn't find a puck around. And then Maroon. It all out. Back to Kerfoot. Kerfoot almost got really broken up. Wow, dude, what is this? This is like nothing I have never seen here before. Maroon. And for attack, almost get whipped away. Crow! Stopped by Campbell. The Maple Leafs have their own chance with their puck. Block the pass. Kerfoot's got it on the other end. I tell you, went big and square. Another lightning strike. Campbell whipping around with Brody. McKay passing the neutral zone. Point. Pala. Back to Kucherov. Two on one. Oh, Point just couldn't save it again. That went off loose. Yeah, this isn't looking very good at all because what happened here? Well, there is another chance I need to go back here for the second time. Now, foot. Five minutes left to play for the third quarter of the period. Krennic stopped by a goaltender again. Bunting up by Point. On the board, Sukucharov. Hold on, shot blocked, and he makes a save. Bunting, in now with the puck control. Oh, took a big hit with the collide, almost went up to aggressive on the, on the offense, the defense. Hold on, 2-1. Point resets the puck, they won't pick up the 2-1 attack. And Bunting has it covered out. And no power play is given up here in between Toronto and T Tampa Bay. Wow, he went big. Big attack out there. Maple Leafs might need to smell some. Might need to smell some syrup. <laughs> I don't know if I could say syrup, but that's uh, that's a really uh, harsh way. Point inside. Off again. Campbell saving again. McDonough. Moves it back to Ruda. Moves it quickly over to Stamkos. That is just out of reach. Ruda to McDonough. And inside. Stop me by Kill for Campbell. Bunning in there. Romney with the puck. Birdie passing the neutral zone. Matthews up. He scores. That's two in a row. And they are down, cutting down by one. This is the toughest matchup that no one has ever seen Austin Matthews play. This is what they have, the advantage out there, looking for a chance to tie the game. Toronto makes a, makes a saving at that point, and, and a cut lead. They're going to tie it up. No, they cannot. Maroon has his pump control. Maroon inside. Stay big by, by Campbell. Back to Headman. Takes it away by Tavares. Last minute to play in the third quarter. Moves it up to Maroon. Case takes the puck away. 
And now they're going to need to pull the goalie away and have the one man advantage. Belzevski, he's saving big here. And we're just about 45 seconds to play here for the third period. This empty, the empty net is empty for Toronto and they might have the advantage up there. They clear the puck down. Now this way it gets into an icing on Tampa. Still lots of time, but they're going to have wasting too much of the time and they're going to be out of focus here to pick it up. Brody up. Good save by Levesky. Hagel up. Shoots it up across. And he missed the target. Wow. That went off target and that was an off the play of that one. That was very tough. A lot of shot goals here for Tampa and only 32 for, for Toronto. Never face off win for Toronto. Stop the puck by Milevsky. He is saving big here again. Wow, lightning in strike. The Bolt looking for a chance here to take the 2-1 over the Maple Leafs. Tampa wins their faceoff in the defensive zone. Poking a chuck away. And now this becomes a big shot for Eagle. Still no good. And this is a beat icing. Joseph, empty down the scores. And your game winner puts up a two lead advantage for the Lightning Bolt. And that will do it for the end of Toronto Maple Leafs game three victory as the takeaway will be the will be to Tampa Bay. And he's been beat up. And he puts it up. That should do it. The Lightning of the Bolts have won the third game. Congratulating Velilevsky. He's the ultimate and player of this game that can be in the top three. And yeah, this was the best display here. With a huge upsetting victories here for Bolts against the Canadians. But now they're happy enough to be back here again. And that should do it for this game of the Eastern Conference. Stay tuned as we got the Avalanche and the Stars playing at American Airlines Center. Then joining up here to stick around later as you will have the Rangers and Penguins at Pittsburgh for the PPG Paints Arena. And for the last game of this one, it will be a lot hard to see the Wilds and Predators at Bridgestone Arena. Now, let's have your free star players of the game. Number three is Steven Stamkos. One goal and one assist. He only makes it make it snappy. That's what he had. Now, heading off to number two, we have another one for you. Anthony Sorelli. Two goals and one hit. Nice play on attack with a 201, and that was a best play drive. And for number one, Victor Hedman. Three assists and five hits. Unfortunately, no save mates on the on the board for the uh, Valdevsky, as it all turns out to be the one of the best three players on for the on for the lot lightnings on their run. So it looks like that ends here for the games. Stick around later as we'll have the Western Conference playoff matchups of Avalanche and Stars. Peace out everyone for us a while as the Stanley Cup playoff of NHL 22 dial. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and also follow me on my social medias. If you don't, somebody will. And we will get to you back here at the NBA playoffs once we finish the first round for, this, for each games. But right now there's still more games to come. Anyways, have a great night in Tampa and we'll see you all for the next game. Game 4 will be happening back at Amali Arena again, so we'll keep your eyes tuned for that one. Thank you, and good night.